PNP gets 569 million peso worth of new police equipment. The Philippines National Police bolsters its modernization program under PNP PATROL. Plan 2030 through acquiring additional equipment and mobility assets worth 569 million to enhance mobile patrol operations in communities. PNP Chief Police General Camilo Pancratius Cascolan personally led the blessing of newly procured equipment coinciding with Monday flag raising ceremony this morning, October 26, in front of the NHQ PNP building, Camp Began Rafael T. Crane, Kazon City. Today, we showcase the 569 million peso worth of enabling equipment to fill up the requirements of PNP units for mobility, firepower, and communications, which are among the key priorities of our capacity building, modernization, and development agenda, Cascoland said. NHQ Bids and Awards Committee Chairman, Police Major General Emmanuel Luis Lacup presented to the PNP Chief New Mobility Assets, and Rifles consist of 92 units patrol jeep single cab, 6 units 4x4 personnel carrier, 90 units 1000cc heavy motorcycle, 7700 units Galil Ace 5.56mm basic assault rifle and 434 units digital handheld radio. Lacup said these new police equipment were procured by the NHQ Bids and Awards Committee and the Philippine International Trading Corporation PITC. These new police assets were funded from the Capability Enhancement Programs CAPS, 2019 and 2020 Congressional Initiative Allocation CIA 2019 APEC 2015 and Reserve Agency Fund RAF 2018 amounting to 569,092,642 peso lookup added in its initial program, all new patrol jeep single cabs will be distributed to municipal police stations and 10 units for Misimus Occidental Police Provincial Office. At the same time, the Maritime Group and Highway Patrol Group will receive 6 units personnel carrier and 90 units 1000cc heavy motorcycle to boost their operational capabilities. These new police motorcycles will significantly enhance the PNP's capability for high-speed tactical police response to street crimes especially those perpetrated by motorcycle riding suspects more notoriously known as riding in tandem, the PNP chief said. This will be our response to the instructions of President Rodrigo Roa Duterte.to address the increasing crime incidents involving motorcycle riding suspects, he added. In his latest directive, Caspelin signed a memorandum to increase police visibility in streets and major thoroughfares by adding more motorcycle patrols to our existing fleet and initiate repressure training to mounted tactical responders. The mobile forces and high-risk police stations will be the end users of the 7,700 units Galil Ace 5.56mm basic assault rifle while the 434 units digital handheld radio will be given to the National Capital Regional Police Office. For more videos, please don't forget to like click the notification bell icon dot and share. Thank you.